on that How's it going guys? This is Pete from BananaHobby.com. I'm bringing you guys out here uh, the test run of the brand new Sagad Super Racing Catamaran Pickle Fork, basically a uh, brushless boat. This thing is wicked sick hot. Look at this thing. It's gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful fiberglass uh, construction. All fiberglass hull. Aluminum, really nice aluminum hardware in the back. This is powered by uh, two 7.2 volt, 6 cell, nickel metal hydride, uh, 2500 milliamp battery packs. And it's a 2300 kV. Right now it's running on a 2300 kV brushless inrunner. Big water cooled motor here. 70 amp marine ESC running through uh, with water cooling as well. Everything's laid out really nice. Twin battery packs here running on 14.4 volts. Um, just bringing it out to you guys, giving you guys a test run out here at the lake here. Uh, basically this kit is ready to run, comes with the transmitter and everything. Pretty much some um, light assembly inside here with uh, putting batteries in it and then uh, mounting the battery packs and you're ready to go. So once again this is the Sayguide Super Racing um, Catamaran available at BananaHobby.com. So come check us out on the web. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys what's a must with these, uh, these boats is uh, once you get everything hooked up here, first we're going to turn the transmitter on, it comes with a pistol grip transmitter. Got the transmitter on, you want to extend the antenna all the way. We're going to turn the receiver switch on on the inside. And now we're going to go ahead and plug in the speed control to the motor, uh, to the battery pack here, and you'll hear the initializing beeps. Okay, so that's ready to go. What I want to stress here is when you put the hatch cover on, it's held on by two body clips that just basically clip in on the corners here. And this is the part that I want you guys to know that you got to do, okay? This stuff here is called hockey tape. Basically, it's a clear, it's a transparent um, nylon plastic type of a tape that you want to use on the exterior of the hatch hull right here, right above here. So you can go ahead and uh, tape that up just in case it flips over and stuff like that. You don't, you know, uh, get water inside the hull or too much water inside the hull. If you don't have hockey tape, you can opt for electrical tape as well. Black electrical tape works fine. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go ahead and tape, tape this up. Basically just run it down the, the seams here. Really easy here. There we go. So we're just going to go ahead and tape this up here real quick. Right over the seams. And we're gonna get this thing in the water to give you guys a look at how this thing runs. Right. And that's it. You got the four sides there. And that's all you gotta do. And then you just basically give it a run run over with your finger there to make sure it's nice and uh, tight down there so you don't get any water in there. And you're ready to go. Alright guys, let's go ahead and uh, put this uh, Sagad beautiful thing here in the water and uh, give it a run around. All right, we'll check you guys in the water.
on that tale We're no tough bunch But they had the nerves to go and say That all your secrets were drowned With the pioneers who were flooded from the Straight out places And the night we're running barefoot You and I